Burnout's complete for Danny Rowe. Ed Hoover will set up that matchup in a moment. But first, here's Jamie again. Kenny Lang, you won the first race here last year. Now you're going to the semifinals again. What needs to happen for you to keep advancing? Yeah, uh, we just need to keep this summer car quick. We need to keep it consistent. We need to have my driving stuff on the line and uh, need to cut, cut a good light. Everybody out here is super competitive and need to have your A game there. And I think with this car, brand new car, first weekend with it, working great. And with Summit on board, I think we should be in good shape. I think it's going to be a good one. Absolutely. You know, when we're done here, we're heading on across the country. We're heading to Las Vegas, Nevada for the SummitRacing.com Nationals. And you can catch the NHRA Get Screen America show coming your way on ESPN2 at 4 Eastern. That's 1 Pacific, Saturday, April the 9th. Stat guy. Well, the last time we were at Vegas, that was the fall race when they decide the championship. The number one qualifier was Melanie Troxel. Of course, this race, she DNQ'd. Yeah. Tough break for her. We just saw her car owner, the man who brought us the series, Roger Burgess, go out. He did tell me having a lot of problems breaking, getting that car to stop in the beams. Right now, though, it's all about Ed Hoover and Danny Rowe. Another good race. And it's going to be Danny Rowe. The series runner-up from a year ago goes 591.3, 248 miles an hour, and he will pick his lane in the semifinals against Ricky Smith. Hey, that's just a good old drag race there. Both cars left pretty good. The margin of victory at the finish line was just nine thousandths of a second. Take a look at that. Just by a nose, Danny, Danny Rowe advances. And at the end of Danny Rowe, the series runner-up from a year ago goes 591.3, 248 miles an hour, and he will pick his lane in the semifinals against Ricky Smith. Hey, that's just a good old drag race there. Both cars left pretty good. The margin of victory at the finish line was just nine thousandths of a second. Take a look at that. Just by a nose, Danny, Ro Danny Rowe advances. And at the end of round number two, guess what, Mike Dunn? What? Zero turbo cars alive. Wow, who'd have thunk? No doubt, but they will make a vengeance comeback, believe me, when we get to Las Vegas. Star Kingdom Gator Nationals Pro Mod Semifinals. There you see the guys going to be picking their lane, including Kenny Lang, the man I just mentioned, Danny Rowe. That's Ricky Smith. Jamie's with him right now. Side of his car says tricky Ricky Smith. Ricky, what tricks are up your sleeves for the semifinals? I don't know. We're just glad to get by these first two rounds. I'm just so happy that Carolina Drill and Larry Tattero, Kaufman Tank, I mean, we don't have a major sponsor right now, and it's pretty tough. I don't know how much longer we're going, but I just... Praise God right now, and I'm able to stay out here. I've been out here a long time, and I want to make it a little bit longer. I know I can't stay forever, but just thank everybody who's trying to help me, and thank the Lord for letting me be here. Times might seem tough, but right now, he's smiling. Amen to that. Hey, you want to check out a great camera shot? Check out the iMovix camera. We slow down 2,000 frames a second so we can bring you some great crystal clear shots. And look at that car just shaking and baking. We'll do more of it. We call it the semifinals, and it happens in Gainesville Raceway when we come back.